Whip you to the tea. Mm-hmm. It's Gary, baby. <laughs> what up, Gary? Good morning, Ricky. Good morning, America. Good morning to you. It's Tuesday, a beautiful day in the neighborhood. And here's what's happening in celebrity news, y'all. Lanithia Nini Leach, y'all. She is speaking out, and this girl is still talking. And something is going to change. I can feel it in my spirit, y'all. Now, they're saying, y'all, that Nini Leach says, y'all, that she has Real Housewives of Atlanta group text, y'all, to prove racism, y'all. And, honey, they're saying she is slamming her manager for discrimination. Now, they're saying that Nene is calling out her manager. She called his name Stephen Grossman, if y'all don't know who he is, by name. And they're saying she's firing a warning shot to Bravo as she continues her fight against inequality against black women, y'all, in reality TV. Now, they're saying, honey, that Nene tweeted this out the other day, and they're saying... Then, honey, she said, you can't turn on your teammate and get away with this, honey. She said, at Stephen Grossman and so on. And suppression, she said, and retaliation, discrimination, unequal pay, devaluation against black women is real. She said, it is painful and it definitely hurts. And she's going to fight for all the women's rights, y'all. She said, she's definitely going to do it. And somebody said, well, Nina, you tweet every time, every Monday, girl, after the show go off on Sunday. She said, quote, I don't tweet about the show and don't even watch the show. She said, my concern is black women treatment behind. She said, the abuse, honey, you do not see, honey, which is happening, and it's very real. So she said, please, honey, don't make fun of this shit because it is very painful, unquote. Eva, did you go through any racism on the show? Yes. Yeah, by the girls. Not okay. By- <laughs> oh. Oh. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I went through racism by the girls because colorism is a real issue in our community. And they thought because God made me a little more fair that I thought I was better. So I would dealt with more racism with the cast members than the actual executives that work there and paid me handsomely. Okay. But now Nene wasn't but, included in that, huh? She didn't. Well, you know, a lot of all, you know, you notice the girls that call each other ashy and bald headed and all of that stuff. So, yeah, it gets flung around right there on camera. But she said oh, the execs, wow. right, Gary, the management. Her, her, I know, but I'm saying it's, it's hard to eradicate a culture that you allow to persist on one side of the road and ask them not to allow it on the other side. You cannot mm. generate and then unplug. It doesn't work that way. Oh, oh so, snap. Right. Damn, that's she, good, I, know, I like that, girl. Man, say that again, culture. Eva. You can't what now? You cannot generate it and then unplug it when it doesn't no longer services you. You're the one that started it, and now it don't service you, and now you're mad at it. But, baby, you the one started the train. I, I ooh, love, love. I read I'm between that line. I'm going oh. to go ahead and digress, and I'm mad at the kid. Say what, Brad? I love, love. I'm just mad at it. That's <laughs> why, baby. Man, you heard it. She, said that, she said that one, Gary. You yeah, can't she unplug, honey. honey. You can't unplug I mean, and yeah. generate and unplug. Which, oh, yeah. Well, All right. We're going to print that on your obituary. We're going to print that down. I'm getting yeah. some T-shirts made, baby. Yeah, you going to read it You gonna read it for me at my funeral, uh, uh, Ricky? Yeah, yeah, baby. Right, right under intimate. Yeah. Yeah. Syllable Marcel. All right. You heard it from her. All right. Moving on. Another celebrity news. I guess when your career starts to fail, honey, you got to go to the next career, honey. Everybody's talking about Bow Wow, y'all. Bow Wow oh, tweeted y'all that he's God. done with rapping, honey, and is going to embark on a wrestling career. He said yesterday, y'all, that now, you yeah, he said for the wrestling. He said, now I know that this, honey, might sound crazy. He said, but after I drop my last album, honey, I'm going to focus on TV and film. He said, but joining the WWE, honey, he said, it's been a lifelong childhood dream to wrestle in the WWE. Brad, did you know about that? Uh, I did not. Well, they now you do. Him. Him. He I did not, but he, I mean, I, I thought usually like bigger dudes, big old buff, mm-hmm. big. That's discrimination. The, the women are big. That's not discrimination. Uh, that's discrimination. I, I, don't, I don't really watch it, so I don't know much about it. I'm asking. I'm not discriminating. You don't discriminating. have to be big to wrestle, honey. I, didn't, I don't know. I don't watch it. So I'm asking you. I'm thinking of The Rock, Hulk Hogan, yeah, right. the Roddy Rod Piper, like all the ones I used to see. They were she bigger. Said Roddy Roddy Piper. <laughs> Roddy 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 Piper. Rick Flair. <laughs> Rick Flair, yeah. Oh, yeah, the I'm China, the China, the wrestler. She was exactly. a big girl. So the, the, the girls are big. Xena, China, the girls are big. They're bigger than Bow Wow. Yeah. Oh. Well, he said he going to do that, baby. So I guess he got to well, get his hey, career lined up. Well, hey, more power to him. I mean, well, you got to keep yeah. reinventing yourself. That's great. Yeah, that's good, child. Okay. <laughs> All right, the color today, honey, is one of my favorite colors. My color today is mini wheat. Mm. On the high end, you say mini wheat. And on the low end, you say beautiful tan. That's your color for today. You All right, y'all, give it up. <laughs> yeah. Gary, give it up for Gary with the tea. Oh,